everyone today I have a really nifty little camera to talk to you about and it is the Lomo Aquapix. Now these cameras normally have a casing around them to where you can use them underwater and this one did but I found out that I really enjoyed it, its weight and everything without the casing. So I took a bunch of pictures on it, I shot a whole entire roll of film in one day and I had it sent off and I'm going to show you the pictures at the very end of this video um, so you, that you can see sort of what the results of this look like. But as you can see it's a very very not, it's pretty thin. It's a little bit thicker than a wallet. It's focus free. It's got a 28 millimeter lens, which I'm more than positive is plastic because the entire camera is plastic. The back of it comes open very easily. And it's basically your average 35 millimeter camera. You do get the analog crank though. For those of you who are really wanting the analog experience, you do have to crank your film in and uh, out. Well, out mostly. So it's just really cheap sounding, but I actually like that. It tells you what um, exposure you're on. Right now there aren't any. And it's just a very, very basic, sort of very minimal camera. Another really cool thing about this camera is it's super cheap. Depending on where you buy them, if you import them or if you get them from the USA, they can range anywhere from a couple bucks, which for a super cool camera like this is not very bad. Like I said, it's lightweight. You can put stickers on it. You can decorate it however you want because they're very basic, very glossy, very cheaply made. But that's kind of what I like about this camera. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the pictures that I shot on it. And I'd love to hear your opinions on this one.